Okay, so anyway, I should say hello, viewers. Mia, do you want to explain? Yep. For some odd reason, somebody <laughs> here wanted me to teach them German. Indeed. Sorry, you can continue your sentence. I was just about to say I really didn't mean to get through quite this much alcohol. I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah. Um, it has a second thing up there, but I don't think you can normally get up there. Okay. Do you want to take a look at it, or should we move I don't on? Know. Shall we move? I don't know. You tell me. Uh, I've never been in this hotel before. Me neither. Well, okay, I was once, but not right. Um, well, go knock yourself out, take a quick look at the caravan again, and then return. Okay. Uh, name for caravan being... Yes. Ver um oh well, I just had that um, I know bargain. um um uh, from from uh oh it's the first bit of it I can't I Vargan's that easy uh but I can't remember the first bit Keep slipping out well, of, of course, head. Wagen's easy. I mean, you have the Volkswagen uh -huh. that should be known by everybody around here. Yeah. Try Vaughn. 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 Now, one word. Vaughn Wagen. Ah, nice. On a side note, another nudge towards Nordic. I really like that ledge up there. Yeah. I don't know why, but it makes it look sinister. He has that to his building yeah. style, and I like it. What? I uh, I didn't think it looked sinister. I thought in it... Direct X Eleven everything looks sinister and dark. Oh, okay. Now anyway, moving on. Unless mm -hmm. of course you still want to say something about Nordic's building style, which is in generally nice. Yeah. In general, nice. Not in generally nah. <laughs> okay. oh. Do you want to say something, or should I bring up another thing? Uh, no, you can bring up another thing. For some odd reason, people in your comment section have been urging me to teach you how to pronounce their obscure names that I haven't heard before, <laughs> well, except for the few times that they mentioned it to me. But other than that, I don't yeah. think they're actual German words, just um, weird compositions that include German words. Uh -huh. Which, well, if you remember the very first episode where you had me speak in German, do you remember the word you taught me? Um, Abbauschiff? No, I can't actually remember how you pronounce it, but it was Jesus Cow Slappy Christ. Oh, that, uh, yeah, well, that's not a word, that's an expression. Okay, that was an expression. Jesus Schlagen de Kuh Christus. That's the one. That's definitely a German expression, you have to believe me on that. <laughs> I'm studying German, you aren't. Both of you, you and the viewer, I'll take that. <laughs> yes, um, and your German is... Your German studies are very much more advanced than, than mine. Oh, come on. We're currently also reading children's books. Well, yeah, I am. No, I mean, during the lectures at university. You're kidding me. I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> we wouldn't <laughs> yes. do that. That's dull. Anyway, point is, um, mm -hmm. yes, uh, usernames of people. Yeah. On the one hand, the first person who mentioned, if I remember correctly, was... Uh, Ekende, uh -huh. which is a weird composition containing the word corner, I assume. Ah. So Ekende. you try it yourself, Ekende. Ekende. Oh, well, kind of. Yeah? Well, the Eke is the corner. Yeah, Eke. And Ekende is... Um, uh, why are you sinking into the floor? I don't know. How about if I... Ah, okay. Okay, now you're gone. <laughs> Back again. Ah, confusing. Mm -hmm. Um, which could be in theory described as the the action of actually hitting a corner. Okay. Ekende, unekende. I don't know. I'm not sure. He, he probably should tell you himself, preferably in German, in the comment section. So go <laughs> ahead, knock yourself out. Again. <laughs> yeah, and then you know what's going to happen, though, Mia, is uh, a, a kinder will put a whole 
um, put paragraphs of German in my comments, and then I'm going to have to come to you and get you to translate it for me. <laughs> ah. Mia, what's he said? <laughs> I'm going to make them read out aloud too. <laughs> Uh, so, other names? We'll get to that as soon as we're done over here because we've okay. been standing in the same corner for what feels like several minutes now. And this so, like I assume this is the um, tiny room? living room and living compartment, living space. Oh. It Definitely, it's the utmost floor. It has the best view of the caravan if you go towards the um, windows. Mm, Fenster. Ye yes, I did you that. No, I learnt that from one of the books. Oh yeah, right. I've been I remember. reading. Yeah, the. Um, I don't think I've read that one to you, where the flower pot falls off the window. No, you haven't. No. How oh, dare you? <laughs> On the side, no. There's a toilet. Uh huh. You can take a wild guess what the German expression for that is. Uh. Very easy. Toilet. Almost. Just add another letter. Toiletta. Yes. Okay. Brilliant. And those over here are the um. I don't know. What are those? Lockers. Uh, I guess so. Well, in German, those are called Schließfach. Sch Schließfach. Yes. Not a very intuitive name, but all right. Huh? And then moving on, a cupboard full of weapons, I assume. Uh -huh. I don't know what we use them for here inside this motel, but all right. And then pirates. on the pirates. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. You, you need we to have your apparently arsenal. have um, very exciting holidays then. Well, you've just got to be careful, haven't you? In the wilds of space, you need to make sure you've got an arsenal to protect you from pirates. Point taken. Mm -hmm. And I assume up here those are the beds. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we did have beds in here, proper ones, I think. But unfortunately, Boris didn't put that mod into the server, and so we'll just have to deal with those ugly and fudgely things. Cry chambers. Yeah. Uh-huh. Can you guess what those are called in German? Uh, uh, Did I already teach you chamber? No. Oh, okay. Well, chamber, chamber is kama. Kama. So, cryo kama. Cryo kama, yes. And uh, now that we're over here, the second username I'm apparently supposed to tell you about is uh, Hanschke. Hanschke. Uh -huh. I don't know what on earth that's supposed to mean, but if you're creative, it has the word hand in it. Uh-huh. Hand. Hunt. Hunch. Hunchke, whatever that's it. Hunchke. Yes. Yeah. So that's Zurinex's oh, well. uh, Minecraft name, Hunchke. Are you sure I didn't remember? I confuse those people. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I confuse you with others and myself. Me here. What? How you could, could you, as, you might as well be Boris. <laughs> I couldn't tell. <laughs> Point is, I hope those people are happy now. <laughs> what I'm going through for you. Well, that's. I think I'm probably one of the few people who can pronounce Hanschke. Well, now. Now. Mm -hmm. And over here is um, another elevator. Okay. Alf. Zug. Yes, okay. almost. Of Zug. Yes, better. Okay. Which leads up to the roof. Ah, okay. So we can have the best view from up there. In the meantime, a little nudge towards Nordic again. Ouch, ouch, that's my face. You oh, just knocked sorry. into the ceiling. <laughs> Go on, I'll let you... Um... Finish my thought. Mm -hmm. Point is, this thing has its. Um, I think in your video you called it Nira, and that's also what the marker here is called for the the area around here, the GPS marker. Yeah. 
just as an explanation, that's supposed to mean Nordic's Extended Relaxation Annex. Uh-huh. So it has his name in there, kind of. And lastly, this here is one of Nordic's Vengeance fighters. And he painted oh. it purple and looks so beautiful. <laughs> he put those things in. I don't know what they're for. I assume aesthetic reasons, but they look so beautiful. Look at those. He has really a hand for building ships. I just want to rub my face all over it. <laughs> I think that might be considered strange. What? I didn't say that out loud, did I? No. Oh, good. I okay. didn't say the other thing out loud, too, so there you go. <laughs> and uh, back to the view. Yeah. Uh, apparently, this thing is missing safety railings. People like Lord Wiseman would be complaining right now, ah. as they can't handle stairs without safety railings. Ah. You wouldn't know that. No. You weren't there for that. I I'm wasn't sure. there. Short, long story short, um, we had like a huge tower in Minecraft full with random useless stuff like teleporters and um, I didn't put in railings uh. and somebody f fell off the stairs and died and then they put up signs and were protesting about how there should be railings <laughs> and so I just closed down the entire tower. <laughs> For health and safety reasons, of course. No, to spite them. <laughs> If you can't handle stairs, you can also not have stairs. There you go. Be happy that I didn't ban the existence of stairs to begin with. <laughs> mm -hmm. On a side note, have you been timing this? No. Ah, it's uh, too bad for you. <laughs> I figured we'd just um, mosey along and... Uh, um... Hold on a second. Oh. Get over here to the edge and look down there. Okay. With a bit of imagination, you can assume that uh, this is a terribly high tower and down there we can see the ocean of a planet. Yeah. And if I'd be Boris, I'd be pushing you off now. You would. Or jumping down there and telling you to catch me. How about you fly <laughs> down there very quickly and catch me? Uh, I probably could because I bet my thingy's faster than yours. I assume so, so speed. hurry up. <laughs> I okay. think you just kicked me into an orbit around the planet. <laughs> uh, where are you? <laughs> oh, yeah, I think I must have. Oh, dear. Oh, God, you're falling very quickly. Yeah. I, can't. I said fun me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think... Oh, did I just kick you out again? Where are you even? I'm right here. Well, I'm a satellite now. This is my life. <laughs> I think I'm happy. <laughs> okay. Somebody didn't calculate the orbit of the satellite correctly. I'm about to crash into the planet's surface. You're a terrible space engineer. <laughs> you made your satellite almost crash. How dare you? Um, y y Are you going to catch you... me or what? Uh, um, well, you're still in orbit. No, I'm standing on my feet. Okay. I did catch you several times, it's just you bounced off me. That doesn't sound like catching. Or you're very bad at catching. The general idea of catching is to actually catch somebody. Uh, yeah, but you know, it's not like in Portal where I've got magnets. Uh, in Space Engineers, all they let me do is bounce you away. Come to think about it, why aren't there any magnets in Space Engineers? Yeah, it's very bizarre, isn't it? You would think that we'd have magnets. Hold on a second, aren't the landing gears magnets? Or um, magnetic? Maybe. Yeah, yeah, possibly. Now, well, we don't use them. They're terrible death machines. Point is, we're now sitting on the dark side of the planet. And you didn't time any of this, so I assume we're just going to shush them off, right? Oh, okay. Are we done? I assume so. I don't know what else to teach you okay. down here. It's it's dark. We should go lie down and sleep now. All right. <laughs> Let's do that. We'll... <laughs> well, hang on. Why, why would we choose to sleep on the surface of the planet when we've got perfectly good beds back in the hotel? 
Point taken, but I'm too lazy to walk back now. You may push me there, but point is the episode is over. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> right, viewers, thank you for watching. See you again. Bye. That was all still part of the recording. Uh. <laughs>